Okay, I'm here with the with the young lion, the young great Devin the Dream Haiti. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Hey man, let's get right into it, man. What's your thoughts on Ryan's antics leading up to your fight? He never done stuff like this before, so you know, what do yeah, you think um, it's from? Not only Ryan, we never really seen this type of type of theatrics or trolling or whatever you want to call it before in boxing. You know, this is the first time we ever seen this. So um it's definitely out of the ordinary. But um it's Ryan, so uh, if, it, if anybody was to do it, it would be him. Ryan said he's 100%, so do you think he's just playing mind games, or do you think, you know, he's just, you know, it's, it's, it's something he, he's really 100%, he, you know? Yeah, I mean, that's not, that's not you know, for me to, to dig too deep in at the end of the day. Um, I'm going in there and being the best Devin Haney that I can be preparing the best way I know how to, and um, whatever Ryan show up, uh, I'm going to be ready for him. Ryan said recently that you became a Muslim for clout. That's what it looks like to him. What's your What's your response to that? I mean, there he goes speaking on my religion again. Um, I told him about it the first time, and it just makes it it just makes it it validates that he was speaking on. I, I didn't even hear him say that, but um, that that just validates that what I heard was was true about him speaking on my on, on my religion. You know, again. Um, it's not what he said the first time because this is him speaking on it again. Right. Um, I mean, what what sense does that make? But um, at the end of the day, uh, he can say what he wants. To. Yeah, that is crazy. Just because you know Ryan, he shook your hand at the press conference and apologized for dissing your religion. Yeah. So why do you think he just went back after your beliefs after that? Is it, I mean, is it the unstableness or? I mean, Ryan is gonna say we, he he been saying a lot. So um, we can't never we, we can't take none of what he said, says serious at this point because we've seen that he will say anything. I'm not here to judge Haney because I don't I'm not judging him or his dad. But what I do know and what we do we should acknowledge and bring to light is what he did was very disrespectful to his religion. And that should be spoken about and be put into light because um you know it I don't know if people do this, and I'm not claiming Bill Haney or his son are doing it, but are, did they become Islamic or, or Muslim for clout? We don't know. I'm not claiming he did, but it sure looks like it at the end of the day because he's not, again, respecting his religion. At the end of the day, I, I know a lot of Muslim friends, and they're all beautiful people, and the ones that really, you know, the ones that are, like, I, I've never seen discipline like it. They pray all the time. And they're, they're, they're sweet and they're strong and they're cool and everything. But what he's displaying is not what I see from Muslims everywhere I go. So that's the truth. If you don't like it, that's not on me. That's something that you just, it is what it is. But again, I'm not judging them. You know, I, you got to pray for your enemy. So I pray for Devin, you know, and that's it. Devin, when you guys first squared off in the ring four years ago, there was a friendliness to it. There's a friendly rivalry there. Over the last couple of months, it seems like it's gotten pretty personal between you two guys. Why has it gotten to that point? I mean, I spoke on this earlier. You know, um, I heard some things you know, that, that Ryan had said about my religion, which me and Ryan talked about before that he said that he didn't say. So, you know, I'm not going to you know, hold him to that. But at the end of the day, you know, it's, it's personal now, you know, um, and it's, it's, it's bigger than boxing. We've been rivals since we've been 19 years old, and now it's time to seal the deal. It's time that when it counts for everything on April 20th. I think I want to just address that real quick. Obviously, we did it before, but um, you know, I'm not here to disrespect them like that. I don't want to disrespect anybody's religion. I'm not going to keep it like that. And um, he knows I apologize to him. If I did say it, but I didn't. But he says I did. But I just want to shake your head. Hey, I'm not even, I'm not even like that. All right. Hey, 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 since you're telling the truth, then what did Ford tell you? And did he tell you something to beat them? Or, I mean, come out the closet with it, Ryan. Y'all working together. Explain that everybody is in. Tell the truth, Ryan.